Hey y'all, Sean from Nodo Acres. And just when I thought I was done with all of my seeds, I went out to the garage. Big mistake. Big. 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 Mistake. I found a bunch more seeds that I thought I had put away. So, I realized where they came from. They came from uh, going to the farmer's markets. I got some Black Beauty Zucchini. Oh look, that one's empty. I've got some Crookneck Squash. I have some more Crookneck Squash. I have some Taylor Horton bush beans, pinto beans. I have some Imperator carrots. I, I don't know that I could use that many carrot seeds in a lifetime. This appears to be a couple of Kushaw seeds with maybe some radish seeds. Looks like I got a little bit of mouse action going on there. Yep, a little bit of mouse action. This is some uh, purple hole peas. What else I got in here? Some sugar baby watermelons. <clears throat> Let's see, we've got some Bloomsdale spinach and some New Zealand spinach. Uh, some Kentucky Wonder pole beans. Um, that was cherry bell radishes. I think that's the seeds that are all over the bottom of my my bag that these are in. There are a bunch of seeds in here, y'all. Ah, look at there. Some fresh dill that was given to me by a neighbor last year. <laughs> some sugar snap peas. Those look like they're a couple years old. I might have to try and plant some of those, see how they do. Looks like I have some Dollar Tree seeds in here as well. Oh, there's a whole bunch of sugar baby watermelons. I don't know that I could grow that many sugar baby watermelons in a lifetime, so I may be giving some of those away. I have some garden beans and some oregano and some Lisbon bunching onions and some sweet basil and some more Lisbon bunching onions and some parsley and some mint, some more crookneck squash, some California wonder peppers, some Alaska peas, holy cow. That's a few marketer cucumber seeds right there. I don't think I'll ever plant that many cucumbers, so I'll be giving those away too. Got some butternut squash, some chives, some basil, some dwarf gray sugar peas, some large red cherry tomatoes. Hmm, I might have to put those in a separate pile. And try some of those, see if they grow. We got some broccoli. Uh, looks like some more white Lisbon bunching onions, some more broccoli, some more cilantro, some more of those large red cherry tomatoes, some more broccoli, oh look at there, some heirloom mammoth melting sugar peas. I'll have to save those, we like those, give those a try, see if they'll grow. Alright, let's push some of these back, make some room for some of this other stuff. We got some sugar snow peas. We got some more carrots. We got some Shasta daisies. Some more Shasta daisies. Some mint. Some mammoth Russian sunflowers. Some chives. Some tender green improved bush beans. Some pinto beans. Some more sweet basil. Some more dwarf gray sugar peas. Some more cilantro. Ah, looks like that sweet basil bag got a little chewed on. Some more pinto beans. Some more sweet basil seeds. 
some more black turtle bean seeds. What else we got down in here? Uh, some more mammoth Russian sunflowers, two of them. Oh, look at there. There's some burpless cucumbers. That's a lot of cucumber seeds there. Don't know that I'll get through those. What else do we have in here? Huh. Looks like I have some Kushaw seeds and maybe some pepper seeds in here that I saved. I have got, yep, that's what these are. A whole bunch of radish seeds, cherry bell radishes all over the place. Falling out of my bag here. So, guess I'll have to uh, organize those. Let's see what we got in this bag. This bag looks like it might just be bulbs. Looks like I got some Blue Mountain Gladiolas. Some Border Harmony Gladiolas. And some Firecracker Gladiolas. Oh, that's cool. I might have to plant all those this year. It's come on time to plant those too. So we'll have to uh, get those in the ground pretty quick and see what happens. See if those bulbs come back to life. If these uh, bulbs grow, then I, I hold out a whole lot of hopes for these seeds. I think these seeds are from last year or the year before's uh, farmer's market and uh, sales at... Uh, at the Dollar Tree and uh, Walmart and a couple other places. So these are all seeds that Maddie and I saved. So this envelope is very full, as you can see, of yellow marigolds. Got a few cobra beans in here. Got some Kentucky wonder beans in there. Got a whole bunch of purple hole peas in here. This is orange marigolds, and this is some of my sweet basil seeds that I saved. And, huh, a mystery envelope. That should be fun. Anyway, I guess I better get busy and add those to my collection and clean up my mess. Thanks for watching, y'all. If you like what you see, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell so you don't miss out on anything that's going on here at Nodo Acres. We appreciate you. Have a great day. God bless y'all.